This is a brief introduction into the WordPress social media automation course. We're going to take a look at the things that we're going to cover and uh, do a little rundown on the modules in this course. So first off, we're mainly going to talk about automation through RSS and WordPress plugins. And if you don't know what RSS is, we're going to cover that in this course, so don't worry about it right now. We will be using free and paid third-party tools. Now, don't let the word paid frighten you because everything you're going to learn in this course can be done for free, absolutely 100%. A quick note on Twitter. I am going to cover how you can post updates to Twitter automatically. That's a big part of this course. However, I don't recommend you use Twitter to post to other services. Like, for example, I don't recommend you post your Twitter updates to Facebook. And in fact, LinkedIn has recently stopped this practice, and they don't allow people to update their LinkedIn status anymore from Twitter. And like I said, Facebook can be problematic. Mainly, they allow it, but mainly the problem is that people are very protective of their Facebook accounts, and they don't like to see too many updates. And a lot of the experts out there will tell you it's a bad idea. And I can tell you from firsthand experience, it's a bad idea. So we're going to automate everything, but we're not going to do it through Twitter. We're going to automate to Twitter. And we have all these other tools to do automation to Facebook and all the other places. Okay, now a quick rundown on the videos in the course. The first video is going to explain RSS. And if you've never heard of RSS or don't understand how it works, by the end of the video, you will. If you do know what RSS is and are very familiar with it, you can go ahead and skip this part of the course. Next, we're going to cover Twitter feed and other similar third-party auto-posting tools. These tools use RSS to post to the various social networking and social media sites. So again, if you don't understand RSS and don't know what it is, just watch that first video. Next, and this is probably my favorite part of the course, I'm going to show you how you can leverage the power of WordPress to syndicate your old content. Now, if you've been producing content for any length of time, you understand the problem of producing content every week, or some of you might be posting daily, is that some of your great content gets buried, right? And in my own experience, I've even had people ask me questions. They'll, they'll email me or they'll find me on, on Facebook, and they'll ask me questions that I've actually answered in the past and written articles about, but they weren't aware these resources existed because they were kind of buried on my site. And so that leaves us to figure out ways of, of getting our content, our older content, in front of new people. So there's different plugins you can use, and one of the better known plugins is related posts. Uh, you can have most read, that's I use that on my sites, and things like that. But what I'm gonna show you in this third video is a way to get all of your old content in front of new people daily. And another great thing about this is if you don't produce content on a daily basis, you know, you're busy and you just don't have time to do it, you can still post content from your site every day to the social network. So every day you could be driving traffic to your site even if you're not posting anything new. So that's the beauty of this third part of the course here. Next, I'm going to show you how you can share content from other websites and put that on autopilot. So if you want to be known as the quote unquote expert in your niche, you should be sharing stuff from other websites, other authority websites that show that you have your finger on the pulse of what's going on in your marketplace. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set that up and stick that on autopilot. Next, we're going to take a look at plugins for some additional syndication and automation. And then lastly, I'm going to show you how you can put your Twitter account on 100% autopilot. And that means daily posting, growing your followers, and sending out direct messages. All automated, 100% hands-off. Okay, next, if you have questions as you're going through the videos, here's how you can get in touch with me. I've got my G Plus here, LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook, and then at the bottom, my email. So if there's anything you don't understand or you need me to explain further, just get in touch with me and let me know, and I'll try to help you out the best I can. Now, I'm also going to have additional materials available, not just videos. So I'll be sure to put this information in a PDF for you. So don't worry about recording it off, off the screen right now. But I'll leave this frame up for a few more seconds if you want to grab it right now as the music fades out. So that's it for this brief overview, and I will see you in the first video.